But first, some breaking news in Queens tonight. The NYPD is shutting down sex trafficking operations in and around Roosevelt Avenue. Yeah, residents and businesses have long complained about open air prostitution happening at all hours of the day and night, but they vow now to shut it down once and for all. Anthony Lorenzo, he's live for us in Jackson Heights, would look at how all of this went down. Anthony. Well, as we speak, the sex trade here on Roosevelt Island is in the process of being shut down. The mayor and the police department hope this is once and for all. You can see police station here right outside this location on Roosevelt Avenue. They busted down the door a few hours ago, are in the process of looking inside, collecting evidence. And as you can see, the order on the door says it is closed by court order. We can show you a video from earlier this afternoon. This is a look from when those officers broke the glass door to this business here on Roosevelt Avenue, the 9,000 block. And once they went inside, they say they found a disturbing sight. Prostitution, sex trafficking, and beds where gentlemen would come in and have sex with women inside of this location. This was happening at all hours of the day, not only here, but several locations all across here, which is why they simultaneously executed uh, these warrants and closed down at least a half dozen shops in and around Roosevelt Avenue. This is something that residents and businesses here have been long complaining about for at least a year, maybe longer. The mayor getting an earful at a recent town hall in Corona, uh, complaining that women are outside uh, soliciting sex and taking men inside by the arm, uh, asking them to offer money and then pay for these sexual acts inside of these locations, which has ruined business and people live here. The mayor was on site today seeing this whole operation come to fruition. It's clear what is taking place there. Uh, this is really bringing down the quality of life of this community. And anyone who says this is a victimless crime uh, just, you know, really need to see the in inhumane conditions. It's no good for anybody, I think so. Like for the kids also, for the, like, for like people like us also. Like, you know, like sometimes customer like the guys, they come and they say, massage, we didn't massage, and we don't do those things. Like. And as folks walk by tonight going home, and going to patronize area businesses, they are seeing what's happening here. Police actually sealing the doors to these establishments. Again, about six of them all over this area. They say this isn't the only spot across the city, of course, that is doing this sort of illegal activity. And they promise to get to the bottom of it, shutting down these prostitution parlors and also preventing sex trafficking from happening to innocent victims. That is the latest live here from Jackson Heights. I'm Anthony DiLorenzo, Pix 11 News.